right, next up, we look at the Wildcats of Sly County. Last year, overall record, 12 and three, five and zero in the region. First place in the region, put up 578 total points last year. Lost to Bowden in the state championship game. Looking at a recap last season, Tattnall's Square Academy, I'm sorry, 28-21. Early County lost 19-17. Bleakley County also beat Sly County 17 to zero. After that, Central Tubton went down 63 to zero. Macon County went down 28 to seven. Chaco 29 to six. Taylor County 47 to 13. Manchester 28 to six. Marion County, 56 to zero. Greenville, 52 to six. First round of the playoffs, Georgia Military went down, 51 to zero. Second round, Washington Wilkes went down, 58 to 14. Moving into Postseason, Wilcox County went down 55 to 23. Johnson County was next up. They lost 35 to 6. Slap went on a serious tail. Next up was the state championship game versus Bowden. Bowden won that game by eight points. I had a chance to watch the Wildcats a couple weeks ago. Looks like, based on my roster, they'll be bringing 67 players with 16 being seen. Couple notes. Early season. Jack Clark. Kendra Sims. Carson Westbrook will be huge. Huge names this season along with the usual crew but I just think those three players will be the guys that stand out the most taking a look at the schedule I don't think this is gonna be pretty hard of a I may have one possible but I may have one possible but here we go Tatman Square blowout Sly County B this year Sly County beats Early County Bleakley blowout Central. They lose this game. Somehow the Wildcat get lucky. Making County blow out. Chatco 
could quietly win. Taylor Cannon. Taylor Cannon should actually be a whole lot better than before. I'm going to say this game is Taylor Cannon maybe. Taylor Cannon maybe puts up a fight early, but Sly Cannon comes out on top in this one. The big game. From my notes, what will be pretty much the region championship outlook uh, 10-20 at home versus Manchester. By this point in the season, I'm looking at Sly County undefeated with Manchester coming into town. If Sly is healthy, they come out on top in this game. Next up, Sly will face Marion County. I think the Wildcats come out on top in that one. And to finish up, they will face Greenville for the last game of the regular season. I like the Wildcats in that game. Let me know what you think in the comments.